Welcome back to Nene Loves Makeup. So, if you're new to my channel, what's up? Make sure that you subscribe so you can be notified of all my new videos. And if you're a regular subscriber, hi guys, what's up? Like I told you on Snapchat family, that this is going to be a big filming day. And so, yes, it's a little later in the evening, so I apologize for the odd lighting, like half bright, half not. Look at the shadow. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> anyway, this is going to be my Etsy haul, and I love Etsy. I'm shopping on there all the time. I think it's really neat, so um, my more recent shopping hauls that I've done aren't usually like Etsy form, so I just figured I'd share this side of the shopping that I do, and I'll link as many of the shops as I can below, and that way if you guys want to check them out or you like the items I got or something similar, um, to go ahead and do so. And remember, just a note, it is eBay's friendly. I just got one of my checks and yeah, I can't show it to you and all, otherwise I thought about it, but I got over $80 back on shopping. So if you haven't done Ebates, make sure to click my link below, you guys. You get a $10 gift card to a store of your choice. I chose Target because that's my store. And yeah, you get cash back even before you do your purchase you get that ten dollar gift card so why not sh sign up just to get the ten dollar card right smart anyway let's go ahead and get started so i'm gonna start off this video with one of my most favorite things that i've been wanting to use and i've been hanging on to it for probably about two weeks now dying to use it and i haven't because i've been waiting to collect enough things in the mail that are coming for this haul and i'm so excited i'm doing this video because as soon as i'm done me and this puppy are going to be enjoying the rest of the night together so this is from the isley sweet isley company it is homemade soy candles from right here in wasilla alaska so it was really a unique store i met the girl she's actually my, one of my baristas that i get the coffees from every morning and just casually talking and mentioned youtube and then she did and then mentioned i say i love itsy and shopping and she's like by the way i got an itsy store so i thought i'm gonna check it out and I love candles. So, I got a beautiful soy candle. This one is creamy coconut. It says handmade soy candles, hand poured in Wasilla, Alaska. And it smells so good. It's got the uh, vent top so that when you're not lighting it, you can still get all the aroma from it, which it smells amazing. And I love soy. They like melt so much better than the regular wax ones. They more evenly. And when you relight them, there's actually scent still in it. It's not like you cooked it all and now you're just lighting hot wax just to have a light. Like it actually has nice smells. So I cannot wait to use this one and I will let you guys know what I think about it. Oh, it smells, it smells so fresh. Like I'm, it smells like this is, a, like someone just cracked a coconut right open in front of me and then stuck my nose in it. I can't believe that that smells that amazing from being a candle. I mean, I can, but like, oh my God. I mean, I'm not stupid, but it smells so good. So I'm going to go ahead and give you guys a little close up. So yeah, she has many other scents and this was just the one that I was most interested in because it was coconut, but I am going to try others. There's a pink sugar that I want to try. There's a berry one I want to try. And so I can't wait to get my hands on all the other ones. Okay. So with the candles, I got, of course, the creamy coconut melts. Awesome. I love these. I, I burn these all the time. Hand pour some about like the time and the care and not some factory that does it. it. Just like makes it so much better quality, I think. And usually it's actually at a decent price too. So this one is actually a lot cheaper than the ones you can get at the store. Um, this one is the Creamy Coconut Sweet Isley Soy Company. Handmade soy candles, hand poured in Wasilla, Alaska like the other. Along with this, she was very kind enough to send me home with a little sample bag. And this is um, her berries and cream. And she sent me home with three of her little oil burner little cubes. And it smells amazing. I love these. I can't wait. So good. Sweet Isley Company. Little cute card that it has all of their little links. So I will make sure to put that down below. And yeah, Sweet Isley 
company. Gotta check it out, you guys. It's worth it. It smells so good. So the next item I want to talk about is from Bubble Beauty Boutique, and it's from Itzy, and I will make sure to put the links below, but they have so many amazing little handmade goodies. Inside here, I decided to get some lip scrubs. Why not? I got these January or so. I ordered them, so I've been hanging on to these puppies for a while. These are lip scrubs. This one is says Aubrey's French Toast Lip Scrub, and it's just a brown colored lip scrub. It does not stain your lips the brown color, it's just brown, and it makes your lips super soft. I like to do this in the morning before I do makeup when I'm like just toning my face, then moisturizing before I put primer or anything on, and I'll make sure to do this. So that way my face is all primed and primed to start the day with whatever makeup I'm gonna put on. The other one is Peppermint Breath refresher of course it's not in your breath but it's the minty one and yes it is pretty green and that's just because of the mint so she did the brown for the french toast and the green it just to make it cutesy wootsy and they also come in an option where you don't get the colors so you don't have to get them if you're afraid in any way but I already know rest assured I asked and these are not gonna stain in any way so can't wait to use these they came in this cute little pouch little drawstring and then that way you uh, don't lose it. I love lip scrubs. I do. It's like a face mask which is for my lips. So, And she was nice enough to also send me a berry vanilla soap sample. Again, in a cute little baggie and uh, it really smells good. It's really good. The vanilla is almost like a cream so it reminds me of like a berry and cream more than anything else. So, very cute. So the next two I wasn't able to even find where I made these purchases, like the name of the store, so right offhand, I don't know. But I decided to get these. These are knockoff um, beauty blenders, even though I have so many of those. I just thought, you know, why not just have these ones for little decorations? They were all 99 cents each, so I thought for a dollar, I'm probably not going to use them, but maybe, I don't know. Anyway, I just wanted to show you because these are an option for somebody who can't afford the beauty blender. And these are just another option for people. And this one, it says Cas Catel, not Castle, Catel. Anyway, I got a green one, and then I got the original pink, and then I got a little mini one that's orange. So I thought these were cute, and I wish it would say, it says China, it came through customs. It just doesn't have anything, it's all in another language. The next item, everything except for one whole sentence at the top is in Japanese, so I don't know the name of your store, I apologize, so... Again, if I can find it, I'll link it down below. But basically what this is, is it says ribbon false eyelash case. And it is, has a little ribbon. Is it big enough to hold three pairs and the glue? So yay, I don't have to keep sticking my lashes back in the original clear Ardell case that you buy them in. It's really nice to know that I got a permanent little home for my lashes. And I believe this was only like $6 too, and there was no shipping, so. Itzy has great deals all the time. I don't know if this is just a thing that I happen to make a few purchases from out of the country, but again, another item came from Korea, and it doesn't have the name. Um, it's just not English, and I don't understand. So I have posted pictures of this on my Instagram, if you follow me on there. But this is a room decor, and I love Marilyn Monroe. So this is a fan. It is um, stiff, so it's not uh, collapsible in any way, but it's beautiful. It's a really nice, smooth, pretty looking wood for the handle. The only thing I don't like about it is this lime green string. I do not know um, where or why they would put such a cheap and offsetting color such as that. I mean, even a red one would have fit better because of her lips, but I don't like that. And it doesn't make sense because if you hung it up, like that would happen. So anyway I will put a little tack here and maybe one here and one on the top and just kind of press it so that way it stays still and I'm definitely gonna change this out and this little guy I think was only seven or eight dollars too and that's just really awesome find and there was no shipping I don't understand how they make any money off the stores but I mean it's just a great deal so 
like I said, just search anything, search people, search items, it's just, there's so many, even if it doesn't have a category for it, just search it and you'll be surprised on what you can find in there. It's just really great things and so many things are customizable. If it's not something or the color you want or the pattern or just the right texture, they have something for everybody in there. I mean, men and Now, men. this next one is Sticky Essentials. I have done quite a few orders from them. I have three here. Sorry, I'm so close. I just didn't want to keep moving the focus and all that back and forth. So if I'm blurry a little bit, I apologize. There are samples, but they are very, very cute little sample cards. Um, got just a bunch of red. I think it's their February theme color that they were going for. Little owls presents. Just decoration ones. They're not necessarily functional ones or anything else, but they are very, very cute. Anyway, I'm just quickly... These are TV screens, and they're in rainbow to fit no matter what color theme I do. And then these are books, and then these are social media stickers and all the rainbows. Again, to remind myself, Amazon order, and Etsy order, or if I need to go on Snapchat or anything else. Of course, that's upside down, so I apologize, but it's just a way to keep me organized. And then um, these ones are for hydration, you know, eight glasses of water, and then you mark them off for each day. More pink little flags and checks, three um, washi tape samples, cameras, more cameras, um, more TVs. These are the boxes. These are to write in. They're quarter boxes. More quarter boxes, just pretty colors. These are just more posts to go put a little pokey dot wherever you want and then you can write one thing across it if you don't have a full checklist to do. More quarter boxes. And then I love these social media ones. I'm using these all the time. Then these ones are money bags for paydays and such. Um, have the little stethoscope, so it lets you know that this is a doctor's appointment. They were um, little cars and stars and hearts and just different ways to do a checklist. If you want to say social media, <laughs> I like these. They're rainbow, so they can match whatever theme I got going on. These are weekends. And then these are another quarter sheets, and it's a way to like you can fit this. You can say water or exercise or whatever you want and then you tally off whatever you're trying to keep track of. I really like Sticky Essentials. They have reasonable prices. You get your shipment fast and like I said, I appreciate getting some sort of sample that that makes that one of my favorite planner stores. So shout out to Sticky Essentials. Then the next one has beautiful stickers. It is from Lucky Lou Creations. They also got a thank you card because the owner to Lucky Lou is so so polite. She I placed just as a sample to try it out and had mentioned to her that I do planning and that I have a YouTube channel and such and not only did she give me a sample sheet which are actually functional ones which I super appreciate. I just these are awesome. There's checklists, there's the half boxes, and then there's the functional ones, and then the ones that are empty that you can customize it to your own. I really appreciate that. So of the samples, these are my favorite ones to get from Lucky Lou Creations. On top of that, I placed an order, I believe, for like two um, different pages, just like I said, because I, to me it's important to go, how is the cut on the stickers? It's not just a sticker. How is the cut? Is it off? Is it good? Is the sticker removable? Can you peel it off, you know, if you put it in the wrong spot? Is the coloring as saturated as it looked on the computer screen? And, you know, those things are pretty important to me. So sometimes I don't like to place a big order without knowing um, how it's going to turn out. And when I ordered just the two pages, I regretted it immediately, not because they were bad in any way. It was the exact opposite. They have such high quality. The cut is great. The stickiness is amazing. It's movable, but yet at the same time, once it sits for a certain amount of time, it does stay great. The matte pictures are just as beautiful and saturated with color as the glossy ones. I like matte because they're, for me, easier to write on and without smudging or anything. If the ink didn't dry right and you didn't use the right kind of ink for your pen, these are just amazing. And she actually was so sweet to send me two other ones for no other reason except for to just be very, you know, generous and just very thoughtful and I appreciate that so, so much. And I, like I said, I wrote her a big thank you card and I was so, so appreciative of that and I cannot wait to be able to place that order. I've just been having to get my filming done. Priorities, priorities, right? I ordered, these are beautiful pastel colors that say weekend. 
I like that they're straight and not angled so it doesn't take much of my big boxes. They do come in a rainbow set which is optional but these are just the color ranges that I usually use. I like these light purples and pinks and then the blue. The other one that I ordered was the hydrating one. I really appreciated and this is my favorite hydration one of all aside from the weekend one being my favorite. Of all the stores that I've ordered these hydrate ones I really appreciate that even though there's eight stickers this is to me, two months of hydration because this is a week, 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 that's a month, you know, same over here. And basically, you just stick this at the end of the week and then you just go Mondays, Tuesdays, when da, 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 and it's just one sticker, it's cute, and I've been wanting to get these goals of water and these are just really great stickers. She was kind enough to send flag checklist. Now these are one of my favorite ones besides full boxes and functional ones. This is right up there. I love having to-do list and I love that these were like I think almost every color that things are available in. I love it so much. I mean there will not be any sticker that goes unused. Um, the other freebie was these beautiful. You get two of each one and you can customize what you want it to be if you don't have the functional sticker. So if you have a date night or it's a birthday Day or just whatever you want it to use to be. Um, so Louise, who owns the Lucky Lou Creations, was kind enough, I won't read her whole letter, but that, that basically she's being very nice to say she's included a couple extras, so thank you Louise. Um, also that she is giving a coupon for our followers, which is 20% off if you use Nene20. 20% off as long as you spend $5, which is really a great deal. Thank you so much, Louise. And I'll put that link down below. Um, so I don't have time to show everybody else, so I apologize. So I'm just going to do quick shout outs. Um, these are stickers I got from Planning Rose. Mare Bear. Stick and uh, Plan. Oh. Willow Fields. Really great stickers. This is another one that's one of my favorites. Um, Kentucky Craft Corner, which is Crystal. She's very, very nice. Great, great prices. Um, Pretty Little Planners has um, this one. And there's a little coupon code there I will share with you guys. Planner Glitz. Just some little scales. So... Thank you so much for watching my Itsy haul. I love you guys so much, and I'll have all these links below. And be sure if you're ever, ever doing an online shopping, you use Ebates, whether you go through me or you sign up on your own. That is up to you, but please use you, you Ebates. It is worth it. <sighs> long, long video. Such a long day. I love you guys so much. Please be sure to give it a thumbs up, and I'll do more hauls with you guys. And thank you so much. Love you. Bye.